Today we have a 2010 Ford Fusion SE 3.0 motor. Um, the customer is saying that uh, they got a check engine light which came out with a PO102 code. Um, they said it's starting poorly, not the gas mileage is not the best. Um, so we're going to check the mass airflow sensor. Uh, so what we're going to do is show you where that's located and how to do it. Like I said, this has got a P102 code. Uh, your mass airflow sensor, this is a 3.0 Ford motor. Um, happens to be right here. What that does is measure the airflow uh, between your intake and your throttle body. So a lot of times these just get dirty. So we're just going to take this off and clean it and hopefully that fixes it. If not, we'll replace it because we do have the code. So there's that. Undo this. Just got these clips down here. Snap it. Pull it off just like that. And as you can see, this part right here is your mass airflow sensor. You could just clean it in here, but actually to get it better, I'm going to take these out. And if I was replacing it, it'd be the same thing. You just take these two screws out and you put a new one in, but we're going to clean this one instead. See if that fixes it. that this is the uh, mass airflow sensor you can't use brake clean or anything else you got to use something that's actually made for it i don't know about the increasing four to ten horsepower but it's advertisement so what we're going to do is just clean this off and reinstall it see down through the sides there you want to get everything off of there you can That should do it. And you can see what's really important, what you want to clean is that right there. That will get dirt on it. And there's another one right there, same type thing. So just make sure you spray those really good. Let it set for a couple seconds before you uh, start it. But this stuff dissolves really fast. So that's what you want to clean. You don't have to worry about putting it in backwards. This is the proper way right there. If you put it in wrong, the bolts won't, the little screws won't line up. So you can't really screw that up. Start these, tighten them up. Got that slid on, and you gotta push down on this to make sure it hooks in the back like that. And we just put the front clips on, like that. Try to push it down, that's so locked in. Back up here, make sure this is in the proper position. That's tight. Last thing we do, clip this on. Make sure you click, put our lock in position. And that's all it takes to replace or clean a mass airflow sensor on a 2010 Ford Fusion with a 3.0 motor.